Hey there and welcome to the Art Lab. Today we're going to be doing some mixed media by using some alcohol ink and a wooden MDF board. We've got this alcohol ink that we're going to put onto the board and make a pattern and then we're going to use some resin to help seal that in and make a unique art piece. The first step in creating this art board is to seal it. So this is the MDF board and I've just sealed it with white house paint. So I've sealed the board and what I'm going to do now is put a layer of resin down and I'm going to use some uh, pearlescent white and after that I'm going to be spraying some alcohol with a little bit of gold to try to give a little bit of an interesting effect onto this artwork. So the original vision I had in my head for this was to have this white pearlescent background and then sort of a ribbon of alcohol ink going across diagonally across this board which I think would look quite cool. This is actually my first time in making a alcohol ink painting like this and so I learned a lot along the way and it's definitely not as easy as you think. I didn't have any gold alcohol ink so I made my own concoction just using some gold marker powder and isopropyl alcohol. It's not going to have the same consistency as what real alcohol ink will have um, but it's a good little substitute. Right so it's the next day and our surface is dry with the epoxy on the wood board and now I'm going to use a combination of alcohol ink with some isopropyl alcohol and uh, the various coloured alcohol ink and I'll be pushing it around using a hairdryer and also some air in a can. It's just some dust buster but effectively it's just some uh, air in a can to, to blow around and make the patterns. So let's jump in and start that phase of this artwork. So here I'm just laying down some initial isopropyl alcohol to then add the alcohol ink to be able to then push it around with the hairdryer. So first I didn't think this was looking too bad, um, however just blowing the alcohol ink with the hairdryer it really pushed it further than what I was expecting it to go. And so it didn't take too long for me to get a bit disappointed with this outcome and that just the colours were merging together and becoming quite black so I scrapped it. So now to attempt two. I've sort of now obviously got this green background with a bit of gold all around there and so I thought I'd try a little bit different technique here to just sort of move around some of those colours and see what happened. But I got to the stage where I was disappointed and so we're going to be on to attempt three very shortly. Right so hopefully third time lucky this time trying something a little bit different this time just going across the center with that color and then using a wooden stirring stick to just blend a bit of the alcohol ink together. There's a lot of green in this from the blues and yellows so I actually found some white alcohol ink and added that just to give a little bit of contrast. And I'm not 100% sure if I'm still happy with this, but I didn't really want to go a fourth time. So I thought I'd just leave it there. I might do a couple of touch-ups before doing the final resin pour. Alright, so next step I want to do is I'm going to give this a clear coat before I coat it in resin. We don't want the resin reactivating the alcohol inks. So by putting a couple of layers of this clear coat on here it's going to protect the ink so that it stays as it is. It's 24 hours after the clear acrylic spray and now I am putting a flood coat of resin across the alcohol inks to seal it all over. I also really like by putting a finishing coat of resin that you get that nice gloss and it really makes the colours pop.
The flood coat of resin is now dried and the clear acrylic spray that I put on protected the alcohol ink from that final layer of resin. So although I'm not 100% happy with the final output of this artwork, uh, it was a good learning for me having a few attempts and I think next time I'm just going to practice a lot more with different methods of blowing the alcohol ink around the um, artboard. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I do weekly artwork videos and if this is something that interests you then please click that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can see when these videos are released. Thanks very much, stay safe and catch you next time.